Hey everybody, the Banga's back. Welcome to part 13 of Let's Play The Binding of Isaac Rebirth, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, there's still going to be a long wall before I consider doing a hard mode run. And as you can see, if you got a little star on your character, that means you defeated Boss Rush mode at least once for that character. Okay, so Judas and Samson still need some Mom's Heart victories. No, victories, period. So, let's get started. Alright, Rage, a.k.a. Bloody Lust, is a little bit different in this game than it was in traditional Isaac. They made Samson a little bit better from a health standpoint as well. So, in terms of Rage, from now on, whenever you take damage, it actually adds to Rage, making it stronger. And it lasts for the duration of the floor. When you go to the next floor, it resets back to normal. Sagittarius, penetrative shot and shot speed up. Okay, that's the first time I got Sagittarius. I think that was the item that was turning my tears into triangles. Because it's basically a piercing shot. Well, when it pierces enemies, of course. Okay, we got the gurglings. Alright, so if I do take damage here, it'll actually be worse for the enemies. So it doesn't accumulate damage for how many enemies I've killed anymore. Okay, so as long as I manage this fight very cautiously, we'll be just fine. Remember, I got piercing shot so I can hit both enemies if I wanted to. Sadly, no bombs, because getting Lucky Rock is going to be great for my money. If I can find, like, lots and lots and lots of rocks. And a means to destroy them, of course. Come on, hit them! Thank you! That's an HP upgrade. That's awesome. Remember, I got Curse of the Unknown, so I couldn't really see what the items were. Let's see what's over this way to the far right. Oh, we got Super Sloth. Well, every rock that he destroys also gives me money. So, that's a good thing. In every sense of the word. There, all the rocks have been destroyed, so I maximize my money chances. It's a good of the, uh, charge if I got no item. Well, no spacebar item. Alright, so more hits. Super Sloth is not a problem. I might get Bob's Ryan Head or a Tarot card out of this. And it looks like it's gonna be a Tarot card. Yeah, it's a Devil. Devil is good. Hear that, kids of religious parents? Devil is good. <laughs> no bombs. Bad. And I can't pierce through rocks. So, guess it's down to the next floor. Could I get a boss rush mode out of this? Who knows? It all hinges on what I get elsewhere. Well, that room had a hell of a lot of nothing. Samson has decent damage. I haven't taken a look at his stats yet, so I'm going to do that right now. Okay, that's actually decent, and that's my seed there. 7HRZV990. Oop. I don't like this kind of layout. Unless I can get... Whoa! Killed all three of them. That's real nice. Okay, I gotta answer that, unfortunately. Time out. Okay, I'm back. Let's continue on here. That was... Whoa, whoa, whoa. That actually distracted me. So thanks, Mom. I love you too, by the way. But I'm sure Samson appreciates the damage he took because of it. Oh, there was that bomb I was looking for. That's the bomb I was not looking for, but sure, give me an extra two cents. I can't even shoot through the poop. That's so weird. But I can shoot through enemies. Okay, so what do I need now? Well, definitely keys! Oh, now they're all emulated. Well, except for that one, because I took the fire out immediately. Well, the good news is, at least I do extra damage as a result. Yeah, two monstros, because it's champion, yeah. We're using the Devil Card. I'm not going to waste my time with this. Okay, 
If I can group them up together, that's gonna make my life a little bit better. There we go, they're both dead. Okay, shot speed goes a little bit down, but I do have extra tiers in HP. Okay, I'm happy with that. Now, let's just find ourselves a key. Oh yeah, I can really wreck those enemies now. Then again, I did... Oh! That's just me being an idiot. Oh, if only I can fly. Then I can just get money equals power. That would have been so great to have. Especially with Lucky Rock. They synergize so great together. Why do you tease me, Jeebus? Oh, well, there's a key. Okay, that's that's real good. Where do I want to use this bomb, though? Good question. Oh, you're too good to me, game. Okay, I think we might as well just use the bomb right here. Because if it, worse comes to worse, I don't find the secret room, but then I get pushpin and money. But I don't want pushpin in the grand scheme of things. I'd rather Lucky Rock. Because then shops get even more worthwhile. And I think it's down to the next floor. Sure, my damage resets, but remember, I got Cricket's head to make up for it. So, let's continue on here. Oh, if only I had a bomb, then I would have got a key. It's always that thing where you just gotta decide, you know? It's like, do I want a PS4 or do I want, a, want an Xbox One? Then you gotta think about, well, if I want like a PS4, then I have to give up my PS3. Is it really a good trade? I don't know. It could be. It could be a bad one. That's where you think about it. Like, if I give up my bomb, then I won't be able to find the secret room or uncover anything else. That is, if I don't find another bomb ever again for the rest of the floor. But then what if the item room had something really good? You never know that. That's the thing about Isaac. It's all about chance. Is RNG Jesus on your side? Or is he just working against you because, you know, you gambled on his clothes when he was being crucified? He can be kind of bitter, you know, just like his father. But then again, I've hardly ever seen Jesus bitter, except for that one time in the Bible when he threw out the moneylenders. Apparently, he doesn't want people to stimulate the economy. To Jesus, the economy is bad. But then again, in church, they, pa they donate money all the time. So you're passing money around, so why doesn't Jesus get all ape shit over that? Oh, but the church gets money, so that's okay. If anybody else gets money, screw that. That's being, like, hypocritical, in my opinion. Then again, I'm kind of dissecting things a bit too much, and I'm pretty sure people are going to comment having their own theories, and that's okay, too. But the point is, I sometimes I just see these things be satirical, and then others just take them way too seriously. Ah, it's Mega Maw. Alright, I think I can handle this guy a little bit more, thanks to the piercing shots. Flames can still be a bit annoying to navigate around. As well as that... Those tear shots that I have to make sure that I get right under. Whoa! Range up is okay, but deal with the devil is where it's at. Sister Maggie is not where it's at, so I'm gonna leave. And could have grabbed some extra money there. But it wasn't so much in a hurry. You know, I think the secret room could be... Nah, I think it could be right over here, actually. Yes, I was right. Two keys! That was well worth it. Now, the item room is definitely worthwhile, and so could the shop. PhD? Better pills. Pretty Fly is definitely a better pill. I will be taking it. Now let's see what we got in our shop. Actually, first, let's... That was not even a way to the shop. So I'll definitely be looking now. Oh, if only I had one more cent. See, if I haven't left that double room way too early, I could have had it. But no! I had to be an idiot. Be in a hurry. As if I was on the way to a hot date or something. Even though I'm wearing a bandana, I gotta fly around me at all times, and I... Look like I'm dazed as shit. But maybe women love that. Who knows? So, I guess it's down to the next floor without a compass. 
Good going there, Bunga. You were just like one penny shy. Curse of the blind, so I guess that means I don't have a Oh, I do have a map. I was looking on the wrong side of the screen. And again, I don't even have a spacebar item either, so that doesn't even matter in the grand scheme of things. Do you see a tin rock? I really want it. Okay, I can really afford the blood bank in a big way. Oh, cartridge. That just allows me to turn into Pac-Man randomly. Oh, good. That gives me some invincibility on that. I don't think it happened on... Oh, here we go. Yeah, yeah, you can definitely abuse this. I think that's enough for now. Getting a little too ahead of ourselves. Okay, I'm really low on health, but I got 62 cents out of this. Ugh, whoa. Why are you sucking in the red chest, too? Blood. Thank you for that soul heart, though. So all that damage I took from the blood bank is just giving my rage a lot of power. Despite all this rage, I'm still just playing this game. <laughs> but I love it. I can see why this game is hyped so much. All the steel, good. Speed up, good. Remember, I got a PhD, so everything is good. Alright, I got two bombs, so I can go back to that tinted rock now. Plus, there's an eternal heart as well. I want to get all of that. And speaking of that, I will. Maybe I should have placed the bomb that way, because there could have been a secret room. My bad. Whoa! Psychic spiders! That's the first time I've seen those. They be nasty. The key is not nasty. In fact, it's very awesome. Oh, man. If only I could just hold on to this much power. The triangles are death, death devastating, man. I liked it better when it was all squares. Best friend? Um, sure. I'll use you right here. Oh, wow. That explosion was actually huge. I didn't think the explosion would be that big. Man, I'm definitely keeping you around. All right, where's our shop at? Oh, there it is. So I'm guessing to the north was where the boss was. Okay, I don't know what this is. Treasure map! In a way, that could actually be better. Definitely buy that key. And the bomb. And eh, no sense buying that charge. Oh, boss is right over here, actually. Okay. Let's take on Dark One. Facing you for, like, the second straight run. That's weird. But at least I got a much easier amount of range to deal with. Oh, I got Spelunker Boy! That's awesome! I get an HP upgrade, deal with the Angel, and two Eternal Hearts! Okay! This is gonna be strange. I'm gonna have a lot of health. But man, like eight Red Hearts. Okay, so... I kinda wish I had the compass and I can just find the boss right away. But that's not happening. Yeah, let's just keep going. I'm feeling there could be a boss rush potential out of this. Maybe I'll get Dark Boy out of this. Who knows? That was one of the achievements on Steam on the traditional Isaac that I was missing for, like, a long time. It was Dark Boy. It's where you don't take damage on the Depth Slash Necropolis for, like, the two, both levels. Or the one if you got XL. Oh, this room is gonna by itself is gonna cost me a lot of time. Usually when it comes to Isaac, I try to min-max what I can achieve as much as possible. Because you know, I would like to get as much as I can out of this game in each run. 
as opposed to like uh, dragging them out over like several runs and getting very few achievements out of it. I don't want to use best friend here. It would not be worth it. Freed can just get out of the way super easy. Oh, look at all this money. Oh man, I love this. Rich! And wealthy! There's actually a difference. A vague difference, but a difference. Sure, just congregate, I don't care. I forget that all the enemies, as soon as they see best friend, they'll just like try to attack it or go right next to it. If that's their attack, of course, like in the case of the ghost, they like to home in on them. Because of that, I can easily get lots of group kills. This must be the way to the boss. It is. Sometimes the brimstone can just obstruct your view of everything. Alright, made it work. That's good. The adversary? We just beat you! I got bandages on. Oh, I'm not liking this fight at all. If you can just make it dark. And you got a curved brimstone? Really? Oh, no. Where are you gonna land? Okay. Well, as long as I go around this area, I should be safe. Never fought this guy, either. Oh, man, why did it spawn so many spiders? Yeah, I'm actually doing really well. Haven't taken any damage against him yet. Watch out. Oh, yeah, I jinxed myself. I find it funny that the very one second, like, literally one second, as soon as I said I didn't take damage, I took damage. Uh, toothpicks is pretty good. You know what, let's just go straight down. I'm missing the item room, that's okay. I'm feeling boss rush. I think we can make it work again. Oh yeah, and I just noticed why I have red tears, because of the toothpicks, that's why. And I did take some damage, so I'm gonna do even more anyway. Two of clubs, I'll use it right now. The world card, definitely use that. Hermit, yeah, take me to the shop. Magic fingers? Oh, this could actually be useful. I remember this one. Like, every time you pay one cent, you can do a little tiny bit of damage to everything. That could be very awesome. If you have all kinds of money. Which I do. In fact, I'm practically swimming in it. It doesn't do a lot of damage, but... If you do enough damage yourself, then it pretty much can nuke a lot of things. Might have to go back for that hangman card, though. So I might do just that. Uh, don't have a lot of time in the grand scheme of things. I've been using a fair bit of it. Oh yeah, secret rooms right here. Take all that money. Definitely not going to be spending that money. Alright, where's the hangman? Oh, there it is. It was the only one. Okay. Item room is just straight up. Straight up item room, dog. <laughs> uh, that's a tears up. Awesome. That's why it's good to have PhD. Oh, yes, there was an evil heart. That's what I love. Oh, wow, they just went way too fast for my liking. I was not prepared for that at all. That's just me being an idiot. Paralysis, I don't know how that's considered a good pill effect, but... Okay, game, you can be weird like that. Rubber cement! Oh, that could be awesome. Now my tears will just bounce. So bounce, bounce. Come on, bounce. Yeah, I'll use the hangman card right now. 
Get another pretty fly. I found pills, so that's not very good. I guess it just means you won't get bad ones. Fair enough. Let's get some extra money. Hopefully I'll get a blood bag. Blood bag? Yes, I do. And I get all that damage anyway. Oh, this could look really scary. So yeah, let's fight Mom. Oh, it's Red Mom. That's a champion version. Not related to Method Mom, by the way. I'm sure you hear that joke a lot on Northern Lions videos of Isaac. Alright, we got an HP upgrade. And I already got like 10 red hearts. What do I want out of this? Spelunker's hat could be good, but... Uh, I think we're gonna give... Hmm, this one in the upper left is an unknown. E. coli! Okay, that allows you to, like, turn your enemies into poop when you touch them, I guess. I was just unsure what it was, actually. So now I kind of feel like it, it may not have been the best choice. Maybe the explosive bombs would have been. Like, the ones that turn them into fire? Okay, I really need to destroy the Carrion Queen. Wait! It was a champion version. That's why I wasn't seeing any toxic poop. I just gotta, can't forget that I still have magic fingers. So I gotta start utilizing that more. Especially with the likes of Blast Assist around. Like anything that can cause so many shots to go around or is annoying. Oh, it's so great when I shoot walls, they're still a threat to my enemies. Because they bounce. And the more range I have, I can just keep them going at infinitum until they hit something. And with Sagittarius, they just keep on going even if they hit the enemies. So the more range ups I get, the better. Yeah, let's be retarded for this. That may sound offensive, but it's just Isaac. It causes a lot of controversy as is anyway. So what difference do it make? Oh man, blood banks are awesome for this very purpose. I think every boss I've faced so far was a champion of some sort. Remember, champion Gertie doesn't shoot. Oh, screw this guy forever! Thank God it's not two Monstro 2s. Usually the champion version will have a duo of them. Whoa! Apparently that Gish was still able to get me. Oh, this is going amazing! Pin just took a hell of a lot of damage there. So I was hitting all of its insides. Oh, God. Could have been put in a bad spot against Hollow. This is the hollow that's just made of money. Oh, jeez, why'd I walk into that? Ah, that was my fault. Now all I have are red hearts. Nope, I still got a soul heart on that. Oh my god, I'm just wrecking everything! Oh, this is great. I like runs like this where things can just go super fast. Super Fast, the sequel to Super Bad that's all about racing and shit. Where McLovin just gets killed in a car crash and has like pretty much every horny teenager going up to the funeral. That's pretty much how it goes in these movies these days. Okay, you guys can go to hell too. And again, the fallen would feel right at home. I think all these enemies would feel right at home in hell. Ah, Samson's Chains! And for that, you get the Hourglass. Well, I don't like the Hourglass. That one can F right off. Alright, where's the way out to again? Oh, it's over that way. Alright, down to the next floor. Please let this be a Shoal run. I think at this point we should just be getting Shoal all the time. 
Sometimes he wants to go to Shoal all the time. Shoal it all the time. Yeah, that sucked. I was never a good singer. A lot of people can attest to that. If they actually heard me sing. This beggar could be well worth it. Or not. Okay, definitely was worth it. Even though I lost that soul heart as a result, and I lost my red heart, so I gotta pick another one up. That's just me being an idiot, of course, but what else is new? Well, if the extra damage that I take results in me inflicting more damage, that's okay. Why does it look like my shots are, are just firing off the tops of lipstick? Just looks like that. Whoa, 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 it was too late. My shot's bounce just adds a whole lot of unpredictability for my enemies. And I got the money to spare, so I can just wreck my enemies like this. And I don't want the Bible. I mean, yeah, I can instantly kill Mom, but then I'd have to give up magic fingers. And ladies love my magic fingers. Especially when I give them money and cause them to feel weaker. Okay, that was awful. But what else is new coming out of my mouth these days? Oh, got death. There, I can just use magic fingers to destroy the sides instantly. Oh, I should have gotten out of the way of that. Because I didn't, that was me being dumb. Alright, we got a cube of meat, and, uh, well, I got another red heart as a result. Curse of the, curse of the maze? What is this going to be all about? I know I'm just going to be random, but hopefully I don't go into any bad rooms. Oh, magic fingers is so great when you have a ton of money. And you can deal with enemies that have already had enough damage dealt to them already. Like so. That was worth two cents. There. Alright. Is this the way to the boss? No, just the way to some toxic poop. And those other rooms don't lead to anything spectacular. Whoa, three gurglings. They can F right off. I took damage, didn't I? Because I walked on the creep, didn't I? Yeah. Ah, yeah. I am the destroyer of worlds. And destroyer of sentient poop. Or at least just make it smaller. Then it can be destroyed. Fully. Oh. There we go. I didn't take any devil items at all, so I might get heal the angel instead. There we go. Oh, everything just goes so fast. Then again, Mom's heart has a lot more defense than I realized. Sometimes I do a nice bit of damage with magic fingers. So when I get those hamburger guys, like, down to, like, globin mode or ground beef mode, then I would just use the fingers. Oh, there we go. Gotta start moving away from the lasers. That was way too easy. And I got the quarter unlocked. That's not too great an item to unlock, but, eh, money is money. And achievements are achievements. And a dead Satan is a dead Satan. I bet he's all the way to the very top. Wouldn't surprise me. Wouldn't surprise me at all. Remember, I still got over 60 cents, so I can afford to spend this item quite a bit. Especially when you get a little bit more money. As if I didn't have enough. Alright. Oh. Not you. Sometimes I feel like just using a bomb to get out of there. 
But I might as well see it through in case I actually do go the wrong way by divine intervention. Then I have to come back through here again. Because my bomb front is not looking that great. I mean, 15 bombs can seem like a lot, but it's not, really. Sadly, I didn't get Mama's Boy unlocked, either. I'd have liked to have done that. But, what can you do? Try again, I suppose. Because I'm not here to be a quitter. Are you a wizard? Eh... No. It's not worth it. I love when the bomb leeches explode right next to rocks, so I just get even more uses of this item. Can you destroy those rocks for me? I feel like a cheapskate nowadays. Oh yeah, giving me even more money! Lucky Rock is pretty much one of my favorite trinkets right now. I don't know if it's much better than Flat Penny, but... I have so much practical use out of, you know, Lucky Rock, that I can just get almost max money within a couple rooms. Or a couple floors, rather. A couple rooms just be way too much. Oh yeah, E. coli kicked in. That sounds like something terrible you would say to a, ch to a parent at a children's hospital. Well, little Billy got the E. coli kicking in right now. That does not make Mama feel good. I mean, medical bills can get pretty high. Alright, Satan, time for you to die. Yep, that'll be a good time. Okay, that was actually pretty good. Remember, I still got the piercing shot from Sagittarius. Oh, and I still took damage. Here we go! Let's do this! You can't say that my run has little hope. Okay, now I pretty much got my Satan meta figured out. Especially when it comes to, like, the multi-hand blast. Just get in front. Because I can't reach that way. Alright, now I got him to the foot base. Rex Ryan pretty happy. You know, the coach of the Jets. Who, you know, has the foot fetish that everybody just made a big deal out of because apparently it was newsworthy. Like, he likes feet, so what? I mean, I like feet too. If I didn't have feet, then I wouldn't be able to walk. I mean, I don't like feet to the point I'll be licking them. That's weird. But people are entitled to their weirdness. People ever have has their niches. Maybe someone has a booger fetish. But I'm not gonna, like, tell everybody about it. Because it doesn't affect my life in any way, and now Satan's dead. Ah, oh, Blood Rites unlocked. Eh, I was never a fan of Blood Rites, but eh, it's an item. Okay, so I got a very good streak going on in Isaac, and I like to keep it strong. Still gonna be a while yet before I start tackling hard mode. I mean, at least let me get more stuff unlocked before that happens. Okay, I have a feeling we're definitely getting somewhere with all these items. Remember, I still got the uh, part of the Polaroid assembled. Like, all the way back to part three. I think now would be a good time to do a challenge run. I'm gonna do a solar system in the next part. See everybody, thanks for watching.